guys, welcome back to the vlog once again. Uh, today is nice Saturday. Comes to the last vlog. <laughs> I don't know how many days ago it was. Where we took on our Christmas tree. Um, the link for the video is in the description. Now, before I go on in today's vlog, guys, I want to say first of all, Happy New Year to everyone out there. Hope you all had a great New Year celebration with your family at home. Because this New Year celebration was a lot different than normal. Um, so welcome back to the Murray Household, guys. Hope you're all keeping safe and well. Happy New Year once again. Now, in this vlog today, um, I'm sure you probably hear my washing machine in the background, sorry. <laughs> I have a day of washing to do and other things to do around the house. Um, this vlog's a bit of an interesting one. I put it out on my Instagram last night, guys. Um, last night, well, early hours this morning, um, I was actually part of the WWE Thunderdome. Now, if you don't know what that is, uh, if you've been watching my vlogs for a long time, you probably know, I've said this to you before many a time, I've been watching WWE since I was a child. Um, I also wrestled myself for five years, um, a long time ago. In Brooklyn. I think my last match was on the day of Lewis's first birthday, um, which was, what, nearly 12 years ago, which is a long time ago. Um, I don't know if you're there to watch wrestling, but I do. That's my thing that I watch So, in my spare time. So anyway, yes... Um, at the minute with you know with the world going on at the minute obviously people can't go to events and gatherings and stuff like that there WWE came up with this idea where they could build an arena um, with virtual screens where the fans could be at the events virtually where you can sign up on the website get chosen over all the millions of fans that hover in the world to be on a WWE live event whether it be a pay-per-view or a Raw or a Smackdown or whatever and I applied the other day for Smackdown Live and guess what I got chosen now they sent me an email saying uh, they sent me another email confirming the beta, so I thought to myself, I'm not building my hopes up. So I got an email back from them the day before, what day is this, Saturday? It was Thursday I got the email saying, here is your link for the event. You'll be due to come in at 9 p.m. Eastern time, which was 2 a.m. our time. Now the show started at 1, but they asked me to call in uh, with that link into the second hour of the show, which it did. Now, I'm going to show you some of the footage that I recorded last night. Um, I did record a, an intro for this vlog as well, but I thought it wasn't good enough, so I thought I'd do another one for you and I. Because um, obviously I'm more awake and <laughs> it's daytime, so... Um, yeah, it's great because at the end of the day, you know... Obviously can't get the events at the minute. You know, I was supposed to take Lewis to a wrestling show in Dublin recently, which has been held back to the end of next year. Because of the whole pandemic thing as well. You know, it's good as well because, you know, it looks like a proper arena. Okay, it's screens and stuff like that during its virtual fans and all, but... You know... It's, an, it's, it's different, and it's, it's a way of WWE creating something different. And uh, let's just say it was an interesting experience. Um, it's been getting a lot of criticism over the last lot of years about being too scripted, and you know, when guys are out talking, they have to read off a script. And I compared to years ago, where they walked out and just spoke from their heart. And you know, my experience last night was a bit weird with the thunder. I'll explain more to you when I come back to you after uh, I show you the footage. It was a weird experience, but it was. It was different, so at least I can say now, nah, whenever everything goes back to normal and fans are allowed back in the arena again, we look back at this in twenty years' time, and I can say I was part of the WWE Thunderdome at one point. I'm the first Smack, the first show of twenty twenty one. So there you go. So there you are, guys. So yes, I hope once again he's all safe and well out there, and I hope you all had a great New Year's Eve. Um, a lot of you were sending me messages, but I replied to a lot of you um, throughout the day of New Year's Eve. We had a very quiet one at home. Didn't do very much. I was actually in bed for what? One? One o'clock? Yeah. So it was a very quiet one. So it was. So, But hey-ho, hopefully, hopefully 2021's a better year. And all this nonsense going on at the minute. Um, fingers crossed that this time next year, we're back to some type of normality. Where we can do our things that we want to do. And, uh, you know, it's been an eventful year, guys. So it has a very up and down emotional roller coaster every year you know different things have happened and then you can't see people and you can see people and you can't see people and it's been one of those years where it's just been a nightmare so it has so i was going to do a new year's message but i never got around to doing one and talk about the year and stuff but maybe i'll do one maybe i'll do a, a, a video later on today or something just talk about 2020 briefly because it was one of those years where it was like oh, what was next but anyway, guys, I'm actually about to head out here with the kids. So enjoy the footage now from last night. Me, Trump, <laughs> it's a whole we really see. At one point, I thought I wasn't getting into the Thunderdome. Watch the footage and you'll see. It was just a whole palarkey. Anyway, guys, once again, 
Happy New Year. Happy 2021 to everybody. And uh, enjoy the footage. I may return back to you later on because I'm about to head out here with the kids. So I'll see you back here shortly after this footage. So let's get this Saturday vlog started and enjoy the footage last night where I was in the WWE Thunderdome. Oh, come on. Look at this. They give you a link to click on and you can... Why is it? Oh, my God. Try it again. Are you serious? Unbelievable. Guys, I'm going to take a camera and show you this here. Unbelievable. Look at this now. I can't believe that. Here we go, guys. I tell you to click on the link. Gives you this. Boom. Already full. Like, why? Ugh. Unreal. I've been looking forward to this all day too. Nope. <laughs> oh my god. That is disappointing. I am actually disappointed with that. I like literally clicked on the second it, it turned. Well, 9 p.m. Eastern time. Oh. No. We'll try it again. It's full again. Disappointed, guys. Really on. Here we go again. No, it's full. Damn. I'm in. Look. I'm in. Yes. To the front of the line. I'm in the Thunderdome. This is awesome, guys. Is this Halle Berry? <laughs> I want to laugh So far, so good. Going well. Going oh, really well. I'm enjoying this. The symptoms ain't even got predictions like the street There we are. If you know what I mean. My second prediction is that for years, for years. Everybody. I do hang this emotional canvas in my life. Seven, six, five, four, back lame into the three, dome. Two, one. Here wow. we go. We to get in, this match. in the Thunderdome. Yeah. Oh, we're on a break. All right, stand by, everybody. So a ton oh. of energy coming back out of this commercial break. Here we are. Time to go. Ten, nine, eight. eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We got back to have on Fox. Last minute of the show. Oh, last minute of the show. We just told us anyway. What's happening now? Oh, gee whiz. Oh, 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 oh. End of the show. Two, going off the air in one. And we are clear off the air. Great job, everybody in the Thunderdome tonight. Thank you guys so much. Excellent, excellent job. Energy, great energy all night long. Thank you. Give yourselves a big round of applause, everybody. Woohoo! Good job, good job, great show, great job for the first show of 2021. Give yourselves a big round of applause, Thunderdome. Uh, don't forget to sign up for Legends Night, raw, this coming Monday. All right, uh, thank you guys very much. Have a great weekend. Have a happy new year, everyone. Thank you, guys. Thunderdome, good night, everybody. Good night. Well, there you go. That was an experience. It was weird though, so it was, because this guy kept coming onto the mic and saying, boo for this guy, cheer for that guy. Now, commercial breaks were coming back, and, you know, it was weird. But it was fun. It was good watching, so it was. It was an experience. <laughs> anyway, guys, as you can see behind me, it's late. I'm going to bed. So, I will see you tomorrow at some point to continue on this vlog. I've just posted a wee video there on my social media links, um, showing you me at the end of the Thunderdome experience. So, it was okay. It wasn't bad. It was, a, it was an odd experience. 
you'd rather be at the show live personally so you would but unfortunately you can't at the minute so it kind of sucks but anyway guys I'm going to go here now so good night for now and I will see you tomorrow at some point I don't know when but I'll see you tomorrow at some point so hope you enjoyed some of the uh, clips of my experience in the WWE Thunderdome good night see you all later on guys why are you in here torturing me with a wee blanket over you? My blanket, don't be you're like a wee 90 year old. What does blanket ever do to you? You're like a wee granny with your wee shawl over you. <laughs> I just showed Lewis some footage of me on the Thunderdome. Yeah. Here, you were disappointed though, weren't you? Because I was going to bring you into it last night with me. And then it said in the rules, only one person per seat. But then when I was watching it last night, there was like a guy sitting with his young son. So, but by the time I saw that there, you were snoring. No, I wasn't. Yes, you were. You were out cold. At one point, I actually went before I went into the Thunderdome last night. You're, I heard you snore when I was going to the bathroom. <laughs> anyway, why are you got to be blanket around you for? It's my don't, don't be rude to it. What do you like? Big age, did you? I know it's cold, but before the heating on, it's not that cold. You need to get that haircut. Adam, the barber, if you're watching this, should I just shave his dome? No. Well, Adam's not going to be open for another month or two. And then we just found out apparently you're not going to school till the, was it the 1st of February? Like, what is going on? Oh, is Brooke going back to school then? Well, I don't know. We'll find out more about her because she's in an older year. Oh, but my eyes. I don't know. It's an absolute nightmare. Well, as you can see, guys, we've been back home for a while since we were out. Um, it is getting quite cold at her. That's why I've got my dressing going on again. Um, but yeah, the schools are being messed about again, which is a nightmare. So it is. But right, guys, I hope you enjoyed some of the footage from last night with the Thunderdome. So it was, it was fun. So it was, so. But we're back home and the plans for tonight is nothing. Early night tonight, guys, because I am shattered. What are you laughing at? It's true. I'm exhausted. Oh, it is. My sleep pattern's been horrible the last few weeks. I want to say something, but it, you probably kicked my butt off a You just want to play PlayStation no. with me? No, you want to say, I want to say something. No, I will. I was going to say I didn't ask. Didn't ask what? I didn't ask. What are you on about? So you told me you're going to bed early, and I was like, I didn't ask. Didn't ask what? I didn't ask if you want if you're going to bed or not. I don't get you. No, you don't. Oh my oh, god! You are full of nonsense. You know why I mean, people don't ask something, but then you say it anyway. You're you're trying to pick on my. No, brain. and then you say this. I say Whatever. I said. Listen, I'm tired, and I'm not listening Can to I that. Check my dinner? Yeah, he's cooking his dinner. Well, on, did you leave the twelve cups out? Yeah. For the fire brigade. Guys, I'm going to go here and end this vlog early, so I hope you enjoyed the footage from the Thunderdome last night. Tomorrow's Sunday. Um, the, the part of the weather is be nice tomorrow, so I might actually do something outside tomorrow. Monday, I Monday coming, I'll be back to normality, so it's going to be another hectic, back to the normality of hecticness after the Christmas period. So, oh, the joys. So, uh, it's just... Christmas comes and goes so quickly. But this year it was obviously different with all the crap going on. So, Alright guys, I want to go here. So, I hope you enjoyed the footage once again from the Thunderdome. If you enjoyed this vlog, um, I've decided I'm going to do it. One second. What? Will you be ready? Well, I don't know. You need to check. I have. Well, can you see I'm talking? You said so. No. I am going to do that video as I talked about earlier on about 2020. What heavy year it was for us. Because it was a bit of a crazy year. I'll do that probably tomorrow. So we're going to get back home to late. That's now what time is it? Check my phone here. My god, 20 past 8. We're going to get home to like 7. Oh, my feet are killing me too. Anyway, guys, we're going to go over here for now. So if you enjoyed this video, we're doing a live reaction video on Monday as well for the Liverpool game. They're playing Southampton, so stay tuned for that too as well. Coming up on Monday. Enjoy this video today. Drop a like on it. Also, hit subscribe below. Till the next one, guys. See you all soon. Thanks for watching.